Here we go. So the floor is yours, phone. Yeah, thank you. Let me see my, uh, let me share my screen. <clears throat> Uh, I'm pleased to be here to present my project. It's named SNAP Kids Online Protection. So uh, obviously you, you can see in the in the era of internet, uh, children spend more time on the smartphone or smart, in general smart device connected to the internet. So uh, they can approach the co various content in, in the internet, but uh, <clears throat> Among them, there are some uh, some toxic information like violent or something sexual uh, content in, in the internet. So children might not listen to the good and the bad information. Um, parents and guardians also want to separate the children from um, this type of information, but they don't know how and when and where to, to block or supervise the content that ch their children serving in, in the internet. So um, we propose of a framework that can, the first one, the first function is analyze the information that children uh, serve in the internet by AI technology. The second one is a send notifications to parents if some information is suspected as toxic information. The last one is parents can give some advice uh, to their children. And besides, they also give some feedback to, uh, to the data sets to improve the AI model in the future. So <clears> today, <throat> our uh, system architecture, you can see the system um, have four main components. The first one is extension. Uh, why why be extension? Because uh, we focus on non-tech non uh, parents. Uh, some extension is easy for install in the web browser and not requires the, the background and information technology. And uh, the second one is, <coughs> is a server that deploy a AI model. Um, and a notification system. Whenever uh, children uh, request and content, they will be sent to the, the model and the AI model can classify uh, whether it's toxic or not. And if, if it's toxic, it's uh, send the warning email to the parents. And besides, we also provide a data management uh, UI for for parents can uh, have a viewpoint for the request history of children and give some feedback to improve the the AI model. <clears throat> so uh, this is a schedule of our project uh, with three months. The first month we focus on the on the data, uh, collect, clean, label, and feature extraction. Uh, the the second one is focused on the, the AI select, train, and evaluation. And the first one is focused on software like extend, extension uh, UI uh, UI for parents and uh, the API or connect or all of them. Uh, this is milestone and the process. I I uh, we post it in the proposal in the, the website of deep funding. <clears throat> and this is our team. Uh, we, we will uh, deploy this uh, system in, in three months. I am responsible for uh, software development. Uh, Lee is uh, uh, AI researcher of uh, one of the biggest corporation in Vietnam and she is responsible for AI model. Lick is uh, responsible for data and Tian a uh, project management and uh, responsible for uh, deployment in the server or uh, net networking. Thank you for listening.
Very nice, sir. Well timed as well. All right. Does anybody have any questions for Fong? Mm -mm -mm. Mm. Question? Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, well, uh, let's see. Do you, how how do you so? Oh man, I'm trying to think of a good one. Is there anything you want to know from us? Yeah. Mm, Tian has a hand up. Uh, thank you, Tivo. Uh, I just want to add a question for everyone in in the room to make sure that um, uh, the, uh, my question is: Do you see that um, to safeguard your children, uh, your beloved uh, member, from any di digital thing from internet is crucial or is uh, necessary? Can you can you share with us uh, your thought about? How does it work in your country or in your uh, uh, environment? I just want to add to to make sure to to to, to understand uh, the current uh, the ver how uh, you protect your children from internet. Mm. So how, Thank you. How is how is uh, in how in your country are are children protected or how parental controls are a lot of what I, what I've uh, seen on like, uh, the, you know, YouTube has parental control settings for kids, et cetera. Any yep. um, suggestions for this team? Mm, I think uh, there are another uh, solution is, um, but it is manually uh, parent can build some blacklist, but it's just suitable for some uh, some parents that uh, familiar with technology, but for right. yeah non touch parents, just they need some automatically tool. Yeah, a lot of the controls I've I've noticed are like software specific, or in or in this seems like you guys are trying to build something that could watch a whole device, right? like yes. all of all of the traffic going in and out of it yes it's interesting no more questions from the audience see we've got question issues thank you guys let's wrap it <laughs>